Robbie, another postponement, uh, sort of a second in a, in this month, if you like. Just talk us through sort of how it came about and uh, what the referee's final decision was, really. Yeah, I mean, as you can see behind me, the pitch has become unplayable. I think um, it was it was sensible enough to try and get the game on for as long as we could. But at two o'clock, the decision was made. In fairness, by the referee, both myself and Keith were keen to play the game, but it, you know, even what time are we now? Quarter an hour later, it's getting steadily worse. So, um, yeah, very, really disappointing. Um, there's not a lot I can do about it, to be honest. What was his initial comments that led to sort of the first pitch inspection at one fifteen, and then delaying that until two? Yeah, o'clock? well, you try to give it every chance, aren't you? Um, I suppose you don't want to get into the, the, the situation we had at Colchester, where it gets, just gets put back, put back, put back. So at some point, you've got to make the decision, and he has. And in fairness, I think it's the right one looking at how it's deteriorated over the last 10, 15 minutes. Just sort of looking ahead now, obviously you missed a sort of a day's fitness, if you like, match fitness with this game. Is there anything altered now between now and Tuesday night? Yeah, we'll have a, have a little look at the schedule. Um, the issue we're going to have is our training uh, pitch will be unplayable, I imagine, for the next couple of days, um, certainly for football. And then... We'll have to look at an alternative. So I've made a couple of calls there to a couple of contacts and see if we can get use of somebody else's training ground for a little bit.